Hey friends, Sira here from Ohana Yoga. Thank you for taking a moment to tune in with me today. And today I want to talk about the action of surrender. And I do believe that this is something that I've spoken about before, but I have a new level of clarity as I feel I was finally able to embody the concept of surrendering versus just having it be this surface level, I know this is what I should do, but I'm low key planning demise of everything in my life, right? Which is typical. When we're first working with these concepts, um, self-betterment, whatever practices that we try to employ in our lives, we are doing it surfacely. We are doing it theoretically in hopes that one day it will click and we actually will embody that. And for me, I was finally able to embody what it meant to surrender. I was given some information that left me feeling a little unstable with certain aspects of my life. And historically speaking, in a moment such as this, I would have gone down this rabbit hole of Sierra's neurotic mind of like, how can I regain control over something that I don't have control over? But this time I was able to pause. I was able to recognize that tendency much quicker. And instead of stressing myself out, because realistically in that moment, when I received the information, nothing was different. Nothing had changed. I was internally creating these stories in my head of what could be, of what might happen, without actually having any concrete evidence that that's what's gonna happen. I was causing unnecessary stress by my instinct to try to regain control. And what a beautiful thing it was to actually step back and surrender, to actually recognize that this is not a moment that I need to have a plan. This is a moment that I need to let the flow carry me where I need to go. There is an energy a greater force, God, the universe, whatever you want to label it, there's a greater force working for us that guides us and pushes us with these gentle messages, these gentle nudges, and sometimes we overlook them. It's very easy. But when we actually tune into that and we actually listen to that guidance, something really transformative occurs. And so for me, in that moment, when I started to fall back on my historic tendencies and I was able to recognize that pause, that need for surrender. Don't fight the flow. Let whatever happens, happen. So this week, I invite you to employ the concept of surrender. And whether it's surface, whether it's theoretical, it doesn't matter. Just becoming aware of instances in your life that require you to use the action of surrender that you may be fighting against. And one day, I hope that we all can experience the embodiment of what it actually means to surrender. I hope that you all have a wonderful day and thank you so much for listening.